Hey guys, what is up and welcome back to War Thunder with yours truly, WBE886. Now today we're going to be flying out the P-51 D-20 North American on the playing some smexy music, but um, yeah, basically I thought I'd try this out because this along with the uh, Submarine Spitfire Mark IIb is one of the planes that I'm most skilled with. Um, today we're going to be flying out it with the PT second uh, camouflage on that I have created. If you want this skin, uh, a link will be in the description below to the War Thunder Live link, um, and you can download it there. Uh, there's also my tutorial that you can watch on how to install them. Uh, a little bit of background information onto the P-51D20 that you are watching here, or PT second. Um, the pilot was Captain John C. Murray, and he was part of the 300. Uh, 52nd Fighter Group, 487th Fighter Squadron. He was actually uh, among the P-51 Aces. Um, he first started flying in the P-47 um, Thunderbolt, and he got around three kills there. Uh, but it was the P-51, the Mustang, uh, where. My, uh, his A status, and that's what I'm flying out today. So uh, I hope you enjoy this gameplay on Ruhr. Um It's definitely something that I wasn't expecting to get. I wasn't expecting to pull this out of the bag, but I was in literally like a a really good flying mood uh, when I recorded this. So um, if any of you are wondering what uh, my um, my game effects are, uh, basically I put my settings onto movie and the post effects settings I use are film uh, so why that's why some of the colors you may be thinking like why why is this a little off um, also why it's got the kind of like black faded border around it uh, because of the um, you know what would essentially be limited vision through uh, through pilots go go goggles or whatever but yeah um, that's the reason why the video is how it is and I actually prefer playing the game like this because it feels more realistic and it makes the planes look uber smexy. So uh, yeah, I do some daring moves in this um, against 109s and 190s. So yeah, this should be uh, pretty interesting for you. Um, what else have I... what could I say? Um, I am actually working on new skins uh, for those who actually subscribe to my channel for my War Thunder skin content. Uh, there will be a new skin pack coming out soon. Uh, I'm not saying what it is because I want it to be a surprise. Um, I think you guys are going to like it, put it that way. Um, it's I've spent a lot of time on this one, so yes, I hope you do enjoy this new skin pack. But uh, a, bit, a little bit of information about the P-51D Mustang as well in War Thunder. Um, recently it's had a flight model change. Um, basically, uh, you can pull a lot more moves than you could before in the P-51. Um, a lot of moves you can pull now are can get you an advantage in a dogfight. And you'll see me using some of the ones that I've I've worked out myself um, how to do uh, in in this video. And um, I mean, if you play around with the P51 for a bit, you'll learn these tricks. But they are some really good ones you can pull to outwit your enemy. Um, definitely in the P51, it is a very capable aircraft. Um, the 650 caliber machine guns as well. It has got a buff uh, last patch or 1.39 so I think they fire something like 25 or 15 percent faster um, than they than they used to but yeah you can you can really see it take effect against enemy aircraft in this um, you, you see me dogfighting with the fuck off 190 there um, it's just I pre-fire a lot as well trying to get some some good hits and marks on the uh, enemy Focke Wolf there. But yeah, I mean, it's an absolutely terrific plane. Uh, it really is, so uh, I highly recommend you actually go out and get this, uh, whether that will be the premium one or just generally grinding for it. Uh, the skins that are currently in game for it aren't really that good, but, you know, there's some amazing War Thunder uh, skin creators out there. Uh, this one you can get just from the link in the description below, made by me. Um... I will be making a P-51 skin pack as well at some point, uh, dedicated to just skins that I have created for it. But yeah, um, P-51, good plane, go out and get it. 
while we're on the subjects of B-51s, uh, I should probably mention about Duxford this Sunday, uh, again. Um, from what, what I've worked out, the weather forecast is saying that it is actually pretty clear. Um, I mean, it's not amazing, but I, I would assume the planes would still be able to fly, so I am still going to be attending. Uh, I believe there is going to be a P-51 flying. I'm not entirely sure. I have to look at the list again. Uh, but the B-17G is going to be flying. The uh, There's going to be a lot of Spitfires flying. Um, there's going to be two BF-109Es flying. Um, I think there's going to be the Battle of Britain Memorial flight, so that should be a Lancaster. Um, what else? Uh, Hawker Hurricanes. There's loads flying. C-47 Skytrain, etc, etc. Um... I mean, there's loads of great stuff that's going to be flying there, so it's going to be great fun. Uh, me and Ollie are going to be going together, as well as I think Smin will be joining us at some point that day. Uh, make sure, if you haven't already, make sure you follow us on our social media, uh, because that way you can watch uh, or look out where we are, um, where we're meeting up for lunch, stuff like that, because we're going to be doing a fan meetup there, uh, so you guys can come and talk to us. But yeah, I mean... Um, it should be pretty good if any of you are going. You on the Sunday, myself and Squire are attending, so uh, that should be pretty good fun for you guys if you're going to see us there. Um, but yeah, I mean, there's not really much else I can <laughs> mention about in, in this video really, apart from I hope you guys are having an absolutely terrific time um, playing War Thunder and just having general fun. Um, tanks are out now. I'm I'm making slowly making my way towards the Panthers now. So I wouldn't be surprised if there's going to be a video about that at some point. But yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you click that like button below. Subscribe if you're new around here for more War Thunder content. Take care, guys. I'll see you next time.